long ago, Ohio and Kentucky worked together in peace and harmony. Then everything changed when the apocalypse happened. When Kentucky needed help the most, Ohio closed its borders and vanished. Fast forward to a sole survivor. Ironically, a streamer from Ohio named Izzy. Although he spent many hours on Call of Duty, he has a long way to go before he's ready to face the real deal. Project Zomboid is my favorite zombie survival game out there. Do not be fooled by its simplistic look. This is not an easy game at all. Do make sure you like and subscribe so this video can reach as many people as possible so they can also enjoy this game. This is Izzy. Izzy dead. A full-time Ohio-based live streamer who's gonna save the world. Yeah, turns out being a hermit has quite the benefit during the zombie apocalypse. And Izzy... Izzy's not having a good time. Slight downside during the zombie apocalypse. Here, we're gonna help Izzy survive. Oh god, everything's on fire immediately. Okay, um, let's see if there's something in the kitchen here. Oh, some canned food. That's pretty good. All the, uh, the rest of the food is all, all rotten. Dude, I'm, how am I gonna get out of here? It's like, com I'm completely encircled in flames. What kind of start is this? Let's see if I can sneak through. Oh god, I'm on fire. I'm on fire! Ah! Oh, it's my thighs burned. Oh, my health is going down so fast. Um, let's go this way, maybe. See if I can get into a neighbor's house. Oh, maybe the garage has something. Oh god, it's locked. Come on, my health is so low. Can I make it over? Please let me make it. They saw me right there. I don't think he saw me. Is this, like, the fastest you can walk? I mean... Try sprinting with glass shards lodged up your groin. Oh yes, it's open, it's open! Oh god, there's a zombie in here. You know, I need clothes and shoes so maybe I can- Oh no, someone just climbed in there! And another one, uh, I think I'm dead honestly, I cannot escape. Maybe I can kill them. No, I've been bitten, they got me. Ah, uh, so much for our first try. I decided maybe to go this way. Because it seems like way more open, and since I'm so slow, I feel like I can lose these zombies in the forest. At least that's what I'm hoping happens. Fingers crossed. Oh god, there's zombies here. Ah, get away! Oh, that was that was too close. That was way too close for comfort. I'm gonna see if I can uh, lose them in these trees up north here. They're still following, though. I've actually managed to put some distance between them and me. Come on, Izzy. You can do it. Why don't you pull this glass out of your groin, Izzy? With your bare hands, of course. Imagine how painful that must be, though. Okay, my health seems to be still relatively high, so I... But I do need to find something fast. Doesn't look like anybody really followed me. Or will he succumb to his wounds? Okay, I'm really not too sure where to go here. What is this? It looks like... It looks like crops. Does that mean there's a farm nearby? Please let there be a farm nearby. Um, which way should I go? I do need clothes though because this wind chill is so bad. Oh look, a zombie. Is it just a single zombie? Oh, please let it be a single zombie. Yes! Stomp on him! Stomp him! Stomp on him! Okay, give me your clothes. It's freezing cold out here. Give me your clothes. Izzy bathes in the blood of his enemies. That was his Call of Duty battle cry, by the way. Oh, look, a barn. Are there any animals? They don't have animals in this game, which is a little disappointing, honestly. Although it would be really, really sad if they were zombified. Get in the stall. It was good enough for baby Jesus. It's good enough for you. Okay, uh, my um, cold is going down, so I'm less cold in here than I was outside, so that's a good thing. Sit in the, just like, sit in the stall for an hour or something, just to relax. Okay, my health is a li little below half. So I actually need to get out of here. I need to go find some medical supplies. And if there's a barn, that means there's a farmhouse nearby, too. Or this game's just completely screwing with me. Oh yeah, what do we have here? It's a farmhouse. God, please don't have zombies in it. Or maybe just like, if there have to be zombies, can it just be like one, maybe two, and not like a horde? I really need to survive here. Oh, there's one. Come outside. I'm gonna step on- let me step on your head. Let's go, Izzy the Zombie Slayer. Oh, there's bandages. There's bandages, but just one, though. Honestly, we can't be greedy here. One is better than nothing. Bandage up your groin. 
I hear knocking. There's definitely another zombie in this house. There definitely is. The question is how many. Hopefully it's just one. Cannot deal with the horde of zombies. I think it's coming from upstairs, though. Okay, there's a few chocolate chips here. Okay, again, really light on the food here. But you know what? Better than nothing. We should be grateful for what we do have. Even you, Izzy. There's another zombie upstairs. Let's lure him out. Let's lure him. He's in this store. Come downstairs. Let me stomp on your head. Oh, let's have more. Let's take more clothes. Let's rip some of them up, make some of that sheet rope so we can use it as bandages. We gotta go to sleep as well. That should heal me. Although I feel like the lack, the lack of food is gonna be a problem. And I was hoping they would have a weapon around here, but they got nothing. No, not even pots and pans or something. Or like a kitchen knife, nothing. It's really dark outside, so I decided to hang out in this farmhouse and spend the night here. But I really do need food, because Izzy's hungry at this point. And I feel like that's gonna be the death of me, is food. Maybe there's a supermarket nearby, but like, in which direction? I have no idea. I don't know this map. Like, I have no idea where I'm going. There's a shed, and there's, there's no tool, there's nothing in the shed. There's no tools, no nothing, no supplies or anything. What does a guy have to do for a pickaxe or a crowbar or something? Okay, it's finally light, and I do need to go start hunting for food. You know, going north worked for me last time, so I'm just gonna keep going north. And hopefully I find some place to eat before I starve, or before I become food myself for the zombies. Oh, here's a house. Oh, there's a zombie in there. Um, come outside. There's a, I have a game we can play. Come outside. You'll love it. There you go. I just washed these shoes too, and here we are. Shells. Oh, there's nothing. There's just nothing. They're empty. I need a weapon. The kitchen too, it's just completely empty. There's nothing here. Kinda looks like a mini warehouse. God, please have stuff. There's a couple zombies in here too. Nothing! Why is everything empty? There's no supplies! Oh my god, this is like so much- I feel like RNG is really screwing me here. Surely there have to be some supplies around here. Freaking zombies. Mess with Izzy. Now which way should I go? Oh god, more zombies. At least they're attacking me and like- At least they're attacking individually and they're not like ganging up on me in some giant horde. Oh, there's a group, there's a group. Um, I'm actually gonna run away from you. I can actually run again. Who knew removing glass from your groin allows you to run? And I think the wound might be infected too. I really do need medical supplies as well. Good luck with that. God, I do not want to be Izzy right now, honestly. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of zombies. No, 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 no. Stay away, stay away. Good thing I can still kind of sprint. I did start with the athletic trait, which, if you do this, I highly, highly recommend it. More farm, more crops. Or is this... Or is this the one I already went to? I, I don't remember. Oh, I need to find food. That would really help healing this cold, too. I feel like I'm wearing enough clothing to keep warm. I just need to- I just need to find a place I can set up a base and get a food supply. And hopefully a weapon and some medical supplies too. You know these are basic human rights we're talking about. I managed to find a road. Now which way do I go? North or south? So going north really didn't do that much for me anymore, so... I'm gonna try heading south. And there's a bunch of zombies up ahead, so I'm definitely heading south. This run's going so well, I'm not gonna die now, no way. 
Considering the amount of zombies here, I'm hoping this leads into town somewhere. Where I can find like an obscure little building I can hide in. That hopefully has food that's not spoiled or rotten. Okay, run away, run away, run away, run away. I think I lost them. Oh no, oh god no, there's so many of them on this road. Good thing I have the fitness to outrun them, but here's a house. The horde is so close behind me though, but I, I just have to break in real quick to see if there's any supplies. Please be open, please be open. It's open, yes. Close the door. Where's the kitchen? Find the kitchen. Please have food, please have food. Oh, a can opener, that's huge. And peaches, canned peaches. Peaches are gonna save the day, peaches. Okay, the zombies are coming out around. Let me eat my peaches in the yard. Oh, no, no, stay away, stay away. I'm eating my peaches in peace. Get lost. Oh, God, there's so many of them. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, God, there's so many. Oh, there's... Oh, <laughs> ah! Keep walking, keep walking, keep walking. Oh, God, that's a road. There's so many zombies here. I think the population on this map must be set to, like, insane levels. It's either high or insane. There's way more here than normal. Oh, look, a trailer park. See if I can go inside this one, please, huh? Oh, it's open, it's open. Please have food. Oh, marinara sauce. Okay, we've kind of solved our food problem a little, because we got a can opener, which is huge. Oh, they're coming in, they're coming in, they're breaking down the door. Run! Climb out, climb out the window! Oh god, there's so many of them. Yeah, honestly, I don't see myself escaping here. Um, there's just way too many zombies surrounding me. But before I go... I want to eat my finish my peaches. I want to finish my peaches before I die. Get off of my peaches. Oh god, oh my god, look at how many zombies. Oh, I felt they got me. And so it is the end of Izzy dead. Because Izzy is now actually dead. I survived for 23 hours and I killed 9 zombies. Honestly, considering this is the second time I've ever attempted this challenge, I think it went decently well but we'll leave it there for now i do think i got really screwed over on the rng with there being no food or weapons and only like one set of bandages in the farmhouse but if there's anything you can learn from izzy it's that your dreams coming true may not always be such a good thing definitely go check out project zomboid and share this video with a friend who might be interested in bye for now